2016, 2016, it is 2018, we are not two years. Oh god. <laughs> It's Jay, and today I'm here with my April 2018 TBR. It's exam season starting on the 6th, going all the way to the 26th, so not 100% sure how much reading I'm actually going to get done. Probably not a lot, but without further ado, let us get started. So I've decided that for the month of April, I'm going to read all of the arcs that I'm supposed to read because there's about 12 of them, so I'm only going to show you five of them because hopefully I'm gonna get through five books. We don't know. We'll see. But the first one is Ace of Shades by Amanda Foodie. This is supposed to be released on April 10th, 2018. So I actually do really need to get this one done. From the people who have read it, they've said that it's amazing. So I really do want to read it and find out if I love it as much as everybody else because everybody is hyping it. So we gonna find out this month. The next book that I have is called The Trial and this is by R.A. Crawford. It follows an intergalactic organization called Pulse who basically wiped the earth of men and there's only women left and in order to be part of Pulse you have to go through this trial. Only a few humans have ever passed the trial and it's basically the story of this girl named Stella and a girl named Faye, and it's their journey through the trials. I just personally want to know what the heck the trial is if it's so hard, like what is it? So I'm very interested in reading this and also like it sounds like it's gonna be a kick-ass female book, so you know, we like ourselves some kick-ass females. The next book I'm hoping to read is called Murder in Little Shenden, and this is by A.H. Richardson. It follows a man named Mr. Finch who was just brutally murdered, but nobody in his town really liked him. So the list of suspects on who could have possibly murdered him is very long. It follows an inspector who is going through the town trying to figure out everybody's alibis for the night that Mr. Finch was murdered, and it's basically just a murder mystery, and I personally love murder mysteries, so I'm very excited to figure out who killed Mr. Finch because I want to know. The next book that I have is called Screams That You Hear and this is by James Morris and it follows a 16 year old named Ruthie who lives on a very remote island with her mother and father and then one day her parents split up and a new man enters her father's life and things get a little bit interesting from there. Then one day she washes ashore onto the mainland and she is severely burned and she ends up telling her story to a detective and he's trying to figure out what happened to Ruthie and everything that transpired that night. But it sounds really creepy and I'm very excited. Take a shot for every time Jay says I'm very excited in this video because you're probably gonna be hecka wasted. And then the next book that I have is called The Dark Divide and this is by D.K. Stone. The book follows a man named Rich who once managed a hotel but after it got burnt down he is blamed for arson and there's only one man in the town he lives in that actually believes he's innocent. That's when dead animals start showing up on the doorsteps of his neighbors and around town and a bunch of other creepy things start happening and everybody turns to Rich saying that he's to blame. So Rich ends up turning to Lou for some guidance and she actually has some secrets of her own so she has to decide whether she's going to help Rich or keep her own secrets and it's kind of the story of that but it sounds super interesting and I am very excited to read this one. Alright guys so that is my April 2018 TBR. Honestly I'm probably not gonna get through them all because like I said I'm in the middle of exams so you know school comes first and whatnot but hopefully we're gonna get through a couple of them. I have like a million arcs I need to get through so Fingers crossed we actually gonna do it this month. Let me know down below if you've read any of these and what you thought of them and I will see you all in my next video. Goodbye!